Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Well today I have a retail wax haul to share with you and I'm pretty excited about this. So I went to Walmart and this is a course of a couple trips to Walmart and, and then I jumped on over to Hobby Lobby. So these are all going to be mixed up. Um, I've just got these in a huge pile. I think I got about 16 or so wax melts. So I'm just going to go ahead and dive on in. Um, from Hobby Lobby I have Wild Cashmere. And I love this scent. I've never warmed it, but it's beautiful. I really, really like this one. It is White Blossoms, Field Violet, and Dark Patchouli. I'm not a huge fan of Violet, at least not from Scentsy. So I'm hoping that this smells better than the Violets that I've experienced. Now, I like the Scentsy Lilacs and Violets. That one's good. This is beautiful. This is so pretty. This has kind of like, I've got this one right here. It kind of has cozy cashmere vibes from Scentsy. Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe not. A little bit. It kind of has a powderiness. They're almost sisters. Not quite. But it's just an absolutely beautiful scent. And I absolutely love it. So I can't wait to warm it. Let's see. And then from Hobby Lobby, I have a raindrop. This is a repeat purchase for me. I love this scent. The scent notes are Lotus Blossom, Water Mist, and Dewy Moss. This is green. It's fresh. It's watery. To me, it's the, the Lotus Blossom in here almost has kind of a, what is the word I'm trying to say? almost a citrusy vibe, almost like there's a little splash of lime. And Lotus has done that to me before. So, um, yeah. Hold on just a minute. It never fails. My house phone will ring when I'm, when I'm doing a video. <laughs> and most of the time, I, I don't even hardly use, I call it the bat phone. I hardly ever use the bat phone because I just, most of the time we use our cell phones. But I have a landline that that is connected with my internet, which is way cool. It's a free, it's just freely connected with my internet. So that's why I got it. And it's just good to have a, a secondary phone. All right, so back to Hobby Lobby. I have Velvet Tonka Bean. It's earthy. It is so nice. It's kind of like, it almost smells like it has like dark, rich berries in there. But it is very, very nice. Another Hobby Lobby is Flourish. Oh, this one's nice. This is very floral. It's very beautiful, very spring-like. So that's Flourish. And then I have Feeling Cozy. And this is just sugar chestnut swirled with vanilla. This is actually one of my most favorites. I have worn this before. I also like Golden Chestnut from Yankee. It is just amazing, but this is good. So I can't wait to work on that one. All right, so then now I'm moving on to Walmart. If at Walmart, they had these two huge bins of wax and I just kind of like fell into it. <laughs> Barry had to drag me out. Um, I not not really, but I picked up two Better Homes and Gardens, Wild Berries and Cheesecake. And the scent notes are Blueberry, Blackberry, Strawberry, Sugar, Lemon Zest, and Cheesecake scent notes. I might have to put one of these in my next wormy basket. This is so good. This is fruity. There's not a whole lot of cheesecakiness about this one. To me, there's more fruit. It's very, very fruity. I'm picking up on a lot of strawberry. So, yeah, I can't wait to warm that one. Um, now, this one I have worn before. Um, Rainy Spring Day. I got two of these. This is the most amazing scent. If this was a ladies cologne or body spray, I would wear it. This is just a watery, floral, light and fresh. Not overpowering. It is so pretty. I've had really good luck with that one. So that's Rainy Spring Day. And I'm pretty sure it was strong too. I, I didn't have any problems with it. And then I have 
I picked up two white peppermint mocha. This is probably the only somewhat Christmassy one that I have in the bunch. And it is peppermint, coffee, sugar cane, frothed milk, whipped cream, and candy cane scent notes. This is so nice. Very, It's very much a minty. Um, you can really smell the peppermint. It also kind of reminds me of um, those little peppermint coffees that you can get at McDonald's right now that are very seasonal that I wish that they would have a sugar-free version. Maybe they do. But, yeah, I absolutely love this. Never warmed it, so it's going to be exciting to see how that one plays out. And then, believe it or not, I have never warmed. And I got a value size. I got two value size plus a little one of vanilla cookie crunch. I've heard so many good things about this. So, yeah, I just thought, you know what? Let's just go for it. These are $4 here in the United States, and these are two. And so, yeah. So, for basically $10, I got all this. And this is delicious smelling. Yeah, shortbread cookie, buttercream, vanilla, signals. this is amazing. This would be good to warm by itself or as a mixer. Another Better Homes and Gardens is White Tahitian Woods. When I grabbed this one, it reminded me a little bit of pineapple coconut vanilla. And since I can't get my hands on it right now, I thought, hey, I think Barry might like this one. It's very good. It is very good. Very pineapple-y. It is um, bergamot waters, white pineapple, sea salt, coconut, birch leaves, lavender. That's interesting. Sandalwood, teak wood, teak and cedar wood scent notes. Um, to me, I get kind of an earthy pineapple. Really. It just smells amazing with a little bit of coconut. That's, that's what I'm getting. So I'm going to give that one a warm up. That's kind of more of a summery one, but I'm kind of feeling it right now. All right. I know I got two clams of this. The other one I must have put somewhere else, but um, sugared lavender twist. I've warmed this one before and it's absolutely gorgeous. I think everybody needs to warm this at least once to really appreciate this. Oh, here it is. It's right in front of me. The scent notes are raspberries, orange, red fig, pink sugar, vanilla, orchid, lavender, vanilla sugar, and amber scent notes. It's very much a pink sugar, or I would say more like a Scentsy's sugar fragrance. It's beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. I, I would even venture to say it kind of falls somewhere in the middle of pink haze and sugar with Scentsy. So, um... This is very, very nice. I love this scent. Um, yeah, it's nice. Very good. And then I picked up um, this one. I have not warmed ever before. Soft Cashmere Amber. And the scent notes are Bergamot, Amber, Citrus, Sandalwood, Patchouli, Peppercorn, Cassis, and Moss Scent Notes. This is really nice. Um, and yeah, I smelled these because I was, you know, I didn't just want to grab and go. I'm to the point now where we're now where I'm shopping, I'm a little bit more selective. I just don't go along and throw stuff in my cart without smelling it. This is beautiful. This is really pretty. I really get the amber cashmere mix in here. Mm, it is so good. It's just a wonderful, almost a floral. It's really, really pretty. I love this. So that's Soft Cashmere Amber. And then last but not least, this these are not Better Homes and Gardens. And I have not warmed this before either. It's Cotton Candy Clouds, or Cloud. And I picked up two. And the scent notes are Spun Sugar Perfection, Peach Nectar, Shredded Coconut, Pink, La Pink Lady Apples, a hint of lemon and chiffon musk. <sighs> yes. There's that chiffon musk. It's there. 
Mm -hmm. Maybe a hint of apple, but I'm not really getting a whole lot. Um, it's a very girly scent. I guess a very sweet girly scent. It's very, very nice. I like this one. Yeah. So you guys, that is my haul. That's what I picked up. I Hopefully I didn't leave any out. Hopefully I didn't. But anyway, you guys take care. Thanks for joining me today. And I'll be talking to you soon.